سابق سفیر ہمارے ساتھ موجود ہیں اور ڈاکٹر ماریہ سلطان صاحبہ بھی اس وقت ہمارے ساتھ موجود ہیں لیکن سر اگر آپ اجازت دیں تو میں نادر صاحب سے ذرا گفتگو کا آغاز کرنا چاہوں گا نادر صاحب تھینک یو سو مچ فار ٹائم کین یو پلیز ٹیک اس ٹیل می اباؤٹ واٹ دا آفیشیل ٹیک آف دا فلسطین گورنمنٹ آن دس ایشو بیسکلی Actually, the Palestinian Ministry of Foreign Affairs uh, published a statement yesterday mm. that uh, mentioned that this what is happening right now in Palestine is regarding uh, a reaction of the closed political uh, horizon which was made by the Israelis by didn't give any Hmm. any opportunity for peace and for uh, getting a two-state solution so, yeah. by uh, keep attack uh, Palestine by uh, the Israelis army and settlers keep attack daily the Palestinians in uh, their cities and villages hmm. by keep attack by the holy places of hmm. Palestine but uh, the Muslims and uh, Christians hmm. especially Aqsa Masjid Hmm. Uh, by uh, not allow the Palestinian to reach to Aqsa Masjid to make their uh, 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 pray, prayer hmm. there to offer their prayers basically closing hmm. the uh, Ibrahimi Masjid in uh, Hebron so all these actions create this reaction and the only solution is accepting the establishing of Palestinian state on the land of Palestine but with Uh, Al-Quds hmm. uh, or Jerusalem as it is on capital. Hmm. This is the only solution by facilitate uh, the right of return of Palestinian refugees to their own home and territories which was transferred from it in 1948. After that, all these things going to be end, hmm. all this uh, is going to be end. Nadir Sahib, tell me, how do you see basically a US President Biden statement on this issue? They are basically uh, pretending or they are calling Palestinians a terrorist. How do you see this statement? Actually, the you, uh, you, uh, United States of America, as usual, hmm. blindly supporting the Israelis in their criminal actions. Hmm. They are using double standard. Uh, they are supporting occupation in Palestine and uh, are against the occupation in Ukraine. Uh, they are supporting criminal action in Palest- by, made by Israelis mm. in uh, Palestine and they are uh, uh, refusing violence which is happening in mm. Ukraine. Uh, they are uh, supporting the right of return for Ukrainian refugees to their own homes and refusing and, the right of return. And, and what do you think if a world Uh, keeps uh, the super world uh, keeps supporting the illegal occupations of the areas in Palestine do you really think it would be possible to resist the occupiers actually keep uh, you know blind this support the israelis as will uh, lead us for more violence hmm. and more bloody circles in our region hmm. so the only solution for getting peace peace and uh, stability in the region hmm. is by supporting the right cause the right side by supporting hmm. the Palestinian people hmm. by getting their rights according to the national law hmm. according to the international resolutions was was made by the United Nations hmm. Uh, this is the only way to reach peace and stability in the This region. is only the way. Uh, we will get back to you. Uh, proceed basically, our other guests are also with us. Jameel Ahmed Khan, 